I think it's great for the club to be able to announce prior to the season starting Goody signing for another four years, so it's for this year and another three. And um, that's certainly a show of confidence by myself and Josh Marnie and the board in Goody as a coach and what he's producing out on field, but also the program and culture that he's building in our football department. But it says as much about the entire program because what this is, is the board signing off to go, these are the people, this is the leadership, this is the program, this is the culture that we believe will take the Melbourne Football Club to where we want to go over the next four years. And it's an investment in those people and the program. So that makes it pretty exciting. This week we kicked over to 42,000 members and I'd like to think by the time we bounce the ball for our first game we'll be close to 43,000 members and got a lot of kids jumping on board, a lot of Melbourne supporters that have never been members that have said this is the time to make it happen, I want to feel more connected to the club and also there's been a big focus on the MCC members that are Melbourne supporters that haven't ticked the box to become Melbourne supporters and now we're getting literally thousands of those MCC members getting on board as well so um, we've got a really ambitious target, we're, we're trying to look into the 50s and maybe get to 60,000 members this year and if the momentum continues uh, we'll get pretty close to that mark. Well as we approach round one we know the players are all set and ready to go and we'd like to think the supporters are feeling exactly the same way so we're at the MCG on the Saturday we're playing against an interstate club um, we'd like to see a crowd of say 40,000 plus where we create a bit of a hostile environment at the MCG where our players get a lift and, and maybe the Port players feel pretty uncomfortable about the noise and uh, momentum that's being created by a supporter. So I say to all the supporters, the members, the supporters, whether you're coming to your first game or you've been coming for years, we'd love to think the supporters this year are going to get behind the players. We played plenty of times in a state against teams where we're playing against the crowd and 95% of the crowd are actually against the Melbourne Footy Club and we'd love to see the MCG be the opposite. Everyone yelling and screaming and supporting our players.